With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. The question is, which of the following is the most easily hydrolyzed with aqueous KOH solution? Right. Uh, now, what really happens is that, uh, suppose we have CH3Cl, right. Now, when KOH is uh, acted upon this, what really happens is that Cl being a good leaving group leaves and forms a carbocation CH3 positive. And then this OH negative here, it acts as a nucleophile and attacks the carbocation which is formed. Right, so what is going to happen actually, carbocation is going to get formed in each of these cases. So, the carbocation formed here will be CH3 positive, right, the carbocation formed here will be C6H5CH2 positive, here it will be CH2 double bond CH positive and here the carbocation will be C6H5CH, CH3 plus, right, this will be the carbocation here, okay. Now, you have to look at the stability of the carbocation. More stable is the carbocation, more easily it will be hydrolyzed, right? More easily the nucleophilic attack is going to take place. So, uh, if you talk about the first one, this is just uh, methyl carbocation. But if you talk about the second one, uh, basically what you should know is that what factors uh, uh, depend, what factors affect the stability of the carbocation. Now, if a plus M or a plus I effect, which uh, plus M or plus I groups are attached to the carbocation, they are electron donating groups, right, they stabilize the carbocation. Or the carbocation can be stabilized by factors like hyperconjugation or resonance, right. These are some other factors which uh, affect the stability of the carbocation, right. Now, if you talk about the second option here, what is the case here? Now, this is a, a benzene ring and then a CH2 positive. This is the carbocation which is there. Now, this is stabilized by resonance, right? This is stabilized by resonance. Now, uh, if you talk about the first one, there's, there's no group attached to it, right? It is just simply methyl carbocation. There's no plus I effect. There's no plus M effect. There's neither a resonance effect or hyperconjugation effect. Nothing is there, right? It is going to be way less stable. If you talk about the next one here, now uh, in here, there's no conjugation happening. There's no uh, group that is uh, going to increase the um, reactivity of the, uh, it, which is going to increase the stability of the carbocation, right? Therefore, this is going to be less stable. Also, it, here the carbon is sp2 hybridized, so therefore the stability is going to be less only. Now, if you talk about the next one, now this is a 2 degree, which is a secondary carbocation and secondary carbocation is much stable as compared to the 1 degree carbocation. And here what we have, it is this carbocation is stabilized by inductive effect, right, plus I effect, resonance effect and also hyperconjugation. So, there are three factors that are affecting the stability of the carbocation. So, the carbocation which is formed in the case 4 is the most stable and uh, is the most stable and therefore is most prone to the nucleophilic attack and therefore it is easily hydrolyzed. So, the correct answer for this question is going to be option 4. That's all for the question. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.